Alright, what is going on guys? Hope you're all doing well. You've all seen the title, you know what this video is about. Finally got myself a pike fly fishing set up. Been meaning to do this for about three years. Um, finally bit the bullet, bought one. Um, Vision pike outfit, I think it was about 280 quid, something like that. So, pretty cheap, pretty basic. Um, straight up, so came with everything I needed, apart from flies, so I bought a few flies as well. And, yeah, we're going to see if I can catch my first pike on a fly this afternoon. I'm just come to a local drain. Um, thought it would be the easiest option because I don't need to cast very far. And, uh, yeah, let's see what happens. I'm pretty excited, to be fair. Get a fly on and uh, get casting. Right, let's see what flies I've got. Pretty sure I know which one I want to put on anyway. Um, I'll put this gold one on. I was going to put a silver one on, but I think I'll go gold actually. Just got it off eBay. Not too big. I've been told that the bigger ones are pretty difficult to cast. Like I said, I don't really have a clue what I'm doing, but yeah. The water's super low today as well, which this place always fishes really bad when the water's low. But yeah, there's the fly. Get a little bit more line out there. Okay, first. Okay, that was awkward. But we got the fly off the end of the rod. Glad I don't need to be casting far. I think we're going to have to get very lucky if I'm going to get a pike on this today. I've had like one decent cast so far. Oh, we're on, we're on. Oh, we're off. No. I didn't even feel that bite then. Okay, maybe I won't have to get proper lucky. I just had a hit straight away. I didn't even get a hook or anything. Oh, man. Okay, I had a bite straight away. Straight in front of me. Who needs to be good at casting? I don't know. That, yeah, I did not feel that hit at all. I just felt the weight of the fish. So, didn't get a hook set, but... Okay, <laughs> we might catch something this evening then. Oh, that was cool. That would have been good if I'd got my first one straight away then. Before I'd even learn how to cast. This is a nightmare to cast. I need one of those buckets for my line to go in as well. It just keeps getting tangled up. Okay, at least I know the fly will work. This fly that I've put on straight away. Um, just keep plugging away and uh, try to get one now. I'll try to get one pinned anyway. A bit faster retrieve. There's one. There we go. Oh, it's off again. Oh, missed two now. Man. I've been casting in that same spot for ages as well. That was a quicker retrieve then. Just sped it up a little bit. Nailed it. Oh, that's frustrating. Okay. Two bites on the fly. I think it's got a circle hook on this fly, which I thought was a bit bizarre. I don't know if you're supposed to do a different hook set. I know you are if you're bait fishing, obviously, but I don't know if you are if you're fly fishing. Yeah, weird circle hook. I might switch up for, I think I've got some that don't have circles on. I think I'll probably switch for one of them, but missed two fish now, which is frustrating. I did actually get a bit of a hook set on that one as well. I think there's plenty more to be had though. I've had two bites already on the old fly. I'll try this one, a little bit of a brighter pattern. Nice and uh, low light conditions. So a brighter pattern might be a ticket. Not a circle, no, it's a normal hook. It's weird, I brought these flies all off the same eBay seller. <laughs> They've all got different hooks. 
That one. First one was a circle. This is a looks like a Sakuma style one, and that one's got a totally different eye on it. Strange. Like I say, it's only only one fish that I'm after. Oh, this is this cat's so much nicer. Wow. Okay, maybe it was a bad idea using those heavy glitter flies to start with then this EP501 casts way better okay guys next day same spot hopefully we can get one to commit today different fly on because I didn't like those flash bill ones and the other one I was using yesterday bird the hook point on so I can't really use that and I expect a hook fish anyway but let's see what happens today I just want one fish and to learn how to cast a bit better as well as the main options main goals should I say same conditions cold windy quite bright sun so it's gonna be difficult I know that already but there's always chance right, I've just this is my first fish rise, sending on my line. Um, there's definitely bait fish around, so that's always good. It's quite a cold day, so I'm not going to see many rising. And I know, I know there is pike in front of me. Just getting them to bite that's the problem. Especially when I, <laughs> I can't really choose where I'm casting like normal. And oh, I can't cast far because my line just gets caught in everything. There was one following it then. Big swirl behind it. Got it. Oh no! God damn. That's three missed then. Oh, didn't do a strip so I didn't have any line left to set the hook with then. I knew there was one behind it then. Man, that's really annoying. fish on the bottom but could well have been a bite that there we go there we go there we go that one's picked hopefully there we go I don't even know how to play on a fly rod. Let's get this lightning. There we go. Okay. We are hooked. I think it's a big fish. Oh, it's digging. No, it's not a big fish, but first one on the fly rod anyway. Finally, finally got one hooked. Put such a good fight on this light setup. Man, it's really tugging now. Ooh. Tighten that drag up somehow. That's better.
Ready for the net, buddy? <laughs> I don't think it's too bad, to be fair. Yes. First pike on the fly. We missed four. But we got one, finally. <laughs> okay, guys. First fly caught pike. It's not a monster. It's about 70, 80 centimetres. But, uh, yeah, it's a nice chunky fish. So, I'll take that. I'm well happy. <sighs> okay, let's get this pipe back. Pretty narrow looking fish, but me too. See you, buddy. Oh, I'm well happy with that. This sort of pinky, flashy pike. <laughs> Pinky flashy fly. I don't know what you'd call it, but I've got a fish on it, so oh man. <sighs> Mission accomplished. Accomplished. First pike on the fly rod. Landed on. It took two sessions. Still can't cast, but I've had a fish. So if we get a move on now before it gets dark. There's a swirl behind it. Come on. Same as what happened last time. Big swirl behind the fly. Come on. Right from that same edge. Come on, man. Come on. Big swirl again. Well guys, there we go. First pike on the fly landed. So, successful little mission. Took two sessions. Missed four fish first, but we got one. So yeah, now it's time to just learn how to cast and yeah, hopefully get some more sessions. Um, this year, it's something I'm looking forward to learning anyway, uh, pike fly fishing. So yeah, if anyone's got any tips on casting, hook setting, leave one down below. Like, I can't understand that I need to strip set and stuff like that, but yeah, try, trying to remember how to do that's a right nightmare. So, yeah, that's it for this session. Hope you guys enjoyed. Look forward to more fly fishing content this year. And, uh, yeah, catch you in the next one.